Alright guys, welcome back to Copeland's Creatures. So today we've got, uh, we're going to set up a tank because tomorrow we are looking to get a surprise fish for Kenneth. So we're going to go ahead and dive into it. What we've got here is just some basic aquarium gravel. we got red, and then we've got black. Nothing too crazy, but you know to make it feel pretty nice. So guys, the reason we chose red and black were because those are his favorite colors. I don't know if you've seen his jacket, but he always wears the same jacket. He loves it. So we figured we'd go with the two favorite colors, right? And then we've got this little turtle. We just wanted to get this because it's kind of decorative and looks pretty nice. But yeah, guys, that's uh, we got we got this tank right here. Looks pretty nice, but other than that guys, we're going to get this set up and we'll see you in a little bit. Alright guys, so we went ahead and unboxed the fish tank. Um, we put the little pad underneath. It's kind of like a foam material. They called it a leveling pad, that way it won't do anything too crazy. But. Um, other than that, we've really just got to put the gravel in and then the turtle and we should be good other than water. Alright guys, so we went ahead and decorated the aquarium as you can tell. We got the rocks nice and mixed up and I think it looks pretty good. We got a couple sticks as well as our turtle for a nice little decoration. and. Um, we're going to go ahead and put the glass top on. So we want to be really careful with this because this whole aquarium is pretty much just made out of glass. It's got a couple little plastic holders on it. So got to kind of make sure we're gentle with that. But um, other than that, we just got to wait on the fish to get here. And that should be it, guys. So next, guys, we will be adding the water and the filter when the fish gets here. Um, until then, we're just going to kind of leave it right here. But really, we're just waiting for the fish to get here, guys. So we'll see you in a little bit. Good morning, guys. It is the next day after Kyle helped to set up this um surprise uh fish tank and you know for the surprise fish that we have gotten for kenneth um the reason i am shooting video and kyle is not finishing it at this point is because uh kyle had some appointments and so kyle is busy so um and that fish is expected to be here within a few hours and we need to get this set up and running so uh so i'm their cousin john and I'm going to help to uh, get this thing set up. And we did want to shoot the video here so we can share with everybody, you know, this surprise um, set up and fish for uh, Kenneth. Um, so he's going to really like it again. I think Kyle mentioned that uh, the reason we chose red and, and black rock was because Kenneth loves red and black. Red is his favorite color, really. So we mixed up a few items I'm about to add and I'm going to shoot the video on. I'm going to add a rock here to the top of the sticks. Um, I think it'll look cooler, make the fish feel like they're out in the wild at home a little bit. And I'm going to add a little bit of water. I'm going to add some of this rep to safe. Now, usually, you know, I know a lot of tanks come with like, you know, some water safe stuff for fish, things like that. Uh, this tank, unfortunately, did not. Um, so I'm going to add rep to safe. It's equally good for fish as well as reptiles. So uh, I'll put some of that in there. But first, I'm going to add some water in there. Just a little bit, and then I'll add the rep to safe. Um, and I'll show you guys once I get it added. And the reason I'm going to add a little bit of water and then the rep to safe is because um, as I add the rest of the remaining water, as you can tell, decent sized tank, as I add the rest of the water, in you know my opinion, uh, it'll help to go ahead and start mixing some of that up. And as I add the filter on here, which I'm going to grab here in a second, uh, you know, it'll already be mixing, you know, so to speak. It, again, my thoughts. I haven't read anything on it, but yeah. Um, that way it'll be better for this surprise fish um, that we have ordered from Predatory Fence. If you guys have heard of them, 
Um, and the reason we wanted to order from them, Kenneth, um, I'll say is a fan of theirs. He's watched their YouTube channel. He's seen um, predatory fans on other YouTubers' channels, such as Paul Cafaro, Nick Bingo, and so forth. So uh, that's the reason we, we made sure to get him a fish that he loved from there and he, he thought would be decent for this uh, type of tank. So, but yeah, get a surprise. We'll have to get him on here when he does get back from his appointments um, to see his reaction and get his thoughts. But um, stand by, and I'll get some water in here, and, and we'll get some movement, and I'll uh, I'll come back and talk about what's been done, and, and we'll continue progress from there. All right. All right, guys. You'll see that I've added a little bit of water in here. Um, again, I added some of this Repto Safe um, into there, um, so that it'll help make this water obviously better for the surprise fish for kenneth i've also added that rock as mentioned i think it'll look cooler make that turtle feel more at home but as well as the surprise fish of course um this filter it's a filter we had uh we didn't realize at first that this tank did not come with a filter um so we thought it did so uh we had this filter on hand we'll see how it works we may end up changing our filters later on but for right now this is what we're going to go with um Stand by as I get this thing filled with more water and get that filter running. I'll show you guys what it looks like. And then we'll get the glass on there so this thing starts filtering before the surprise fish uh, again for Kenneth comes in. All right, stand by. All right, guys, got that water more full. Should take another gallon or so um, to really fill it up. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and plug in the filter and let's see if we can get that filter running, as you see that I put there in the corner. Let's see if we can get that filter running. Um, and see if it's working. Moment of truth is what this is. Oh, look at that. We have life. Filter's working. Great sign that we can get this water rotating. Again, I'll put a little bit more water in there. Um, and I'll show you guys what it looks like again. But you see that turtle there having a great time. Rock mounted above. Kind of looking like, you know, they're on the wild. So uh, let me put a little bit more water in. And I'll come back to you guys. All right, guys. More water's been added. Um, you know, I think this thing is turning out good. Again, uh, we're still to get this suppressed fish in. Um, I don't want to mention it yet to anyone until Kenneth sees it first so we can get that genuine reaction from him. Again, suppressed fish coming in here soon. So that's why I'm setting up this tank without those guys, you know, talking to you about it or anything because I uh, need to get it running uh, before that fish looks to arrive so that everything can filter through. Uh, make sure you guys leave some comments for for these guys for Kyle Kenneth cadence and so forth so that they know what you think about this tank and anything else they're doing leave some comments let us know what you think about this tank setup let us know if your your favorite color is red or black or either as well uh, but but hey stand by we're gonna get that new fish added here soon and we'll get uh, Kenneth's reaction to his new fish so all right